Hello team, it's Arun Singh here and now I'm presenting the whole content of my course of ELK Stack. In my first lecture, I'm giving about the author introduction. In, in second lecture, I'm telling about the what is the course that I have, uh, what is the course structure. In second section, I have the complete ELK Stack introduction where in lecture two, I will tell about the Elasticsearch basic then log stash basic and then kibana basic in fourth or in lecture five i will tell about the beats or different type of beats and what is the usage of these beats lecture six is very important for the keen people who are majorly interested in what to know about what is happening at the back end it will tell about you how lucid indexing is working behind the elastic search so it is only for that keen developers. Now in section third or installation section, I will first tell the installation of the Elasticsearch and Kibana installation. And in lecture eight, I will tell about how we will work on Elastic Cloud. In this tutorial, I have worked on the trial version of Elastic Cloud and tell about the functionality that is available in the Elastic Cloud. Section four is an advanced section where I will give you the ways to the different ways or different mechanism of data import into Elasticsearch using Logstash and Filebeat. Lecture 9 gives me the CRUD operation into Elasticsearch. Here I have done this CRUD operation using the postman as a client. That is I have created some data, read some data, update and delete some data. In lecture 10, I have given Logstash to import REST API data into a text file. That is, you have a REST API where you will have the GET verb. Now you will uh, basically get that data from that REST API and put it into a text file using the Logstash. Similarly, in lecture 11, basically I have done the same thing, but this time I have put it that data into Elasticsearch. That is, I have taken the data from the REST API using Logstash, Logstash and put it into the Elasticsearch. In lecture 12, I have imported MySQL data into the Elasticsearch using a Logstash. In lecture 13, it's an important lecture, we have imported the Nginx log data into Elasticsearch. In lecture 14, I have imported the Apache log data into Elasticsearch. Lecture 13 and 14 are little bit connected in one of uh, half of the lecture i have given up how the import will happen and half of the lecture i will explain the configuration in lecture 5 is very important lecture where i have tell about the import of nginx log data into elasticsearch using file beat and log stash i again repeat using file beat and log stash so here i have also explained how you will install the file beat in lecture in section 5 i have the kibana visualization where in lecture 16 i have come up with the data visualization that is how you will visualize the data from different ways i have taken the example of two or three graphs here in lecture 17 i have the dashboard creation that how you can create the dashboard from that data visualization in data 16 i have come up with some creative ways that how you will create the data it is not just about you will go and create the basically graph but what are the indices and what are the meanings i have explained that dashboard i have also come up with the sharing of the dashboard and also the basically uh, html which you can go and ingest into some html and you can use the dashboard in different different ways lecture 18 and 19 i have come upon the installation of the winlog beat and metric beat and how they will capture data and inject that into the elastic search. I have put it them under the Kibana visualization because installation is and management is a little bit easy here since we have done it before for file beat but how you will visualize their data is important. So before getting to the dashboard of will log beat and metric beat you need to know about data visualization that is lecture 16 and 17 is important here. After section 5 in future i have planned to add the section 6 where i will come upon the security features of logstash and elasticsearch basically where i will have the rules and securities of the elasticsearch and i will put that security 
यूजर नेम पासवर्ड इन किबाना लॉग स्टैश एंड इवन इन द बीट्स टू इंपोर्ट द डाटा लेट्स सी हाउ वी विल गो थैंक्स